guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to the sunny side of florida it is beautiful here as you can see i am pretty much getting dressed um, for the day because dad and i have a date later we are celebrating valentine's day a little bit differently um because like if you guys follow me for any amount of time you kind of know that i'm just full-on family and michaela has to actually work valentine's day caroline has school again on valentine's day because it falls on a random monday this year um so monday will probably be celebrated probably all of us here i don't know quite what i'm going to do yet um but anyways you'll see that in a vlog to come but tonight is dad and i's night because chris oh, say so michaela's at work and Caroline's at school currently. So dad and I are sneaking away actually on a date. It's been forever since we've been on a date. Um, because usually, even though a lot of people are like, oh, you have the girls to watch Christian, either they're at school, Caroline's with Ethan, Michaela's at work, and honestly, we don't try to treat um, our other two girls as babysitters. I know, it's weird, we feel guilty about that. So, Christian actually has like a play date at the YMCA because we're members of that. So this is kind of like it's kids night out. I don't know if they're doing it particular. I know. Woo! I don't know if they're particularly doing that for Valentine's Day, but he gets to go. It's like movies, parties. Hopefully he's good in his boot. Um, but that's what he gets to do tonight. So we're like, how convenient that that takes place and dad and I can actually celebrate Valentine's Day even if it's a day early, so yay. Y'all know how most women ask for um, roses probably for Valentine's Day <laughs> or something, I don't even know because I don't know, I'm just not like a big, hey, Valentine's Day. I want him to celebrate my birthday more than a Valentine's Day, but he, this year you better be celebrating my birthday or you're in the doghouse, <laughs> so you know. But this is what he got me, or he says this was my Valentine's Day present, right? It's your Christmas, your Valentine's This birthday. is every year. If I get one thing like that I like, I get claimed, it's everything. <laughs> So anyways, this is supposedly Valentine's Day present. I don't know, he just decided he wanted rocking chairs. Actually, I've been wanting them for years. So I don't care what we're claiming them. Well, holiday, so it's nice. We're gonna sit outside together like old people, baby, and rock away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -oh. What'd you do? Those extra bolts are important. It's every time. No, it came out. Oh. I like this color. I let him kind of pick our color too. I was like, yeah, just pick it because all of them's going to match. Beautiful. I don't care. It's a nice color. So later I will take a rock in it and you'll see if I fall to the ground or not. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully not. Decide what we're going to do tonight. We're going to drive down the road. Yeah. There ain't nothing out there, girl. Hey, what happened to those old timings where you parked in your truck? You watched the sun go down together as a date? That died. We elected people, politicians in the place. What does that have to do with our sunset? <laughs> Y'all, he's a little salty today. I obviously left for a little bit. We got All my RBA done. brothers has hit me up and they're like, all of us operators, there's a lot of us that are, every single service that I've been with, I keep in touch with all my brothers and we're all in the same little chat. So we're amping each other up. <laughs> yep, that's it, amping each other up. Then has released today, and he showed it to me on his phone. And at first I think it's just PSYOPs. I'm like, no, that's not even real. Like, that can't be real. He always instantly goes and like Googles and researches and tries to find out if it's truly real or not. I guess it's real. I don't know. Like, I'll have to show you guys the picture, but, and you're gonna say, it's full of crap. Because at the end of the day, it probably is, and it's probably just a distraction, honestly, for us to, to think about this picture rather than, I don't, I don't know. Then what's really going on and we're, we're about to go, you know, oh, to WAR. So much going on, so much <laughs> evil corruption. I know. So they need you to focus on these things that I ain't getting tied up in, guys. All right, guys, this is what he showed me. So, you can pause it, you can read it, you can whatever. I thought it was a joke. <laughs> I mean, it has to be, just look, they wanted that to be a joke by the picture alone. 
Nobody's taking that seriously. I don't know. I believe that you dress, I mean, we're not gonna start in this vlog what I believe or not, but let's just hands down say, I believe you dress for the occasion. If nothing more, and that's definitely not dress for the occasion of what you just got elected for, so. Whatever, guys. We won't make this vlog about that. Hopefully my husband's not gonna be salty the afternoon. We're gonna rock in our rocking chairs and go on a date. When do you think you can ride up front? Get your booty in the bag. We made it. We dropped Christian off and we are at um, this little place in Plant City. It's called Kill Farms. I say little, but it's, it looks like a decent sized farm. If you guys remember when we first came here, I brought you out here and we were gonna strawberry pig. <laughs> They were out by the time we got here. So, but tonight we're going just for dinner. Dad was like, I'm in the mood for a farm place. And I was like, good thing, because I done looked it up and knew where I wanted to go. So, yay, we agreed on something. He did see a couple seafood places on the way here. He has been wanting it, but I'm glad we decided and made it here. So, let's go in and eat. Andy, I'm gonna show you some menus. And whoever enjoys farms, I'm gonna show you some farms. Pinch on my butt. I did put a dress on for you. Sure. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm about to get copyrighted. They have a live band here. Super cute, now that you can see it. But, what did we just get? Gator nugget. We got gator nuggets to start off. Check this out. This, is, this looks good. Blueberry wine. Red, white. They have your ales. All that good stuff. The one looks good on here, Dad. Black and mahi looks good. They got this, this is a little menu. Salads. Burgers. Surf and turf. Oh, a gator. Black and mahi. Yep, that's what I'm going to want. <laughs> Easy choice. Alright guys, let's try this. That's good. That's really good. <laughs> Sometimes gator can be a little bit gamey. That's good. Guys, on to dinner. I mean, everybody knows what this is, and it looks it looks good. Bad thing is, is I'm already halfway full from all the appetizers. <laughs> yeah. Too hot? It's not too hot. It's just it threw me off. I didn't expect it. So. Maybe eat it with the rice. That's what I did. Y'all know I'm honest. The appetizer stuff was banging. I don't like the sauce. You didn't need sauce on black and mahi. This man's talking about he's got to pee. He's done peed like five times. And no, guys, he don't have beer or anything. He's got sweet tea. So, it's a cute little place, guys. I should have got the burger. That's just where we're at with that. It's so cute. Dad, what do you think? I like being out here. Yeah, it's the nice. Country. Out in the country. <laughs> it's cute. We're walking through the vineyard now. So, <laughs> where's all the grapes at? They ain't no grapes. How are they making the wine? The Suppo tea. Supposedly they make their own wine here. That's why the menu had like blueberry and stuff. I don't see none. Don't even say you gotta pee. For real, don't say you gotta pee. Jeez. He literally just come out here with me. From hand. Oh, there's an animal. Let's go see the animals. Oh, I wanna take him home. Look, guys. Is it too dark? Can you see him? Hey, buddy. I make that noise too when I laugh sometimes. You make that noise when you sleep. <laughs> Definitely know when I laugh. When I'm sleeping, I don't know. Scratching his little behind. Oh. Oh. <laughs> What's that sheep doing? I was playing with her. <gasps> How cute. Guys, this sheep is legit running with her. That is too cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, never mind. I want a sheep. It'll run and play with me. Look at that. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. Dad wants to see if it'll follow him. He didn't run. He wants somebody to run. Come on. Oh, he don't like us like her. They were British. They the lady were? was the lady was definitely British. Oh 
you do. Okay, go dad, go, run. Does it look like I run? No, I got drinks. Okay, I'll see if you run with me. Come on. Touch him. That's rough. Oh yeah, Wooly. You're adorable. You guys, looks like you can come out here and you can have a picnic. And then they have a little bit of strawberries. So dad's little sleep study did come back. That's what he's blaming all this peeing on, is the fact that this new medicine that he started. <laughs> so I guess he has restless leg syndrome. He doesn't stop breathing in his sleep like an old person, so he just twitches in his sleep. I move a lot. They calculated like 500 movements during the night with legs, like drastic movements. So my wife's been blaming me for years. She's like, why is the bed always like disaster after I get out? Well, I flip and I turn. So like they calculate 500 times. So that's why it gets destroyed. Me and Christian can sleep in it. Like if he's TDY or he's gone, we sleep in it and like the covers don't move. Like I must not move at all. Christian must not either. As soon as he comes home, that thing is like destroyed. Like the bed spreads off. And I'm like, what happens in the middle of the night? So I guess he has restless leg syndrome. Hopefully your medicine helps. You've only been on it for like two days. I got up like seven or eight times yesterday because I had to pee so much. The side effects that got me was, as I read it, and I was like, hey, did you read this? I don't even know if you guys can see me. It looks dark. I was like, hey, did you read your medicine that you're taking about? And he's like, no. So, of course, I do. It says that it can cause gambling addictions. Yeah, extreme spending of money <laughs> and then also sex, but that ain't going to happen. Yeah, so. and it makes you crave sex. <laughs> so I was like, well, that one probably, you know, nothing. Never happened. Nothing abnormal there, but like how does a drug for restless leg syndrome give you an, a gambling addiction? But guys, there was like serious ones that I did take to note, like falling asleep while you're driving <laughs> and all that kind of fun stuff. They tried to stuff. put me on gabapentin. That's the one you needed, I think. Yeah, but I'm not allowed to take that with my job because of uh, fly status. I guess. I guess I don't want you jumping out of a plane and <laughs> going to sleep. I have no idea. Halfway through, I don't know. So guys, we'll see. We'll see what's going on with Dad. Dad's just got, he's broken. Some issues. I guess I'm in the vlog because we're going to go get our boy. Fingers crossed he had a great time and that he liked all these little people that he met here. Thanks guys for hanging out on our Valentine's Day. And we'll see you in the next. Bye. Back on. We're actually going to pee again, guys. You saw him just pee, right? The camera ain't really been off that long. That medicine makes me <laughs>